Hello, welcome to Botanical Night. In the middle of September, today is September 16, actually night 1617, you can see Desmodium flowering on the streets of Kyoto. Desmodium is an American plant, extremely invasive in Eurasia. So there are two factors visible today which help, I think, in its invis invisibility. So first of all, Desmodium is changing color of the flowers. Young flowers are pink or pinkish, and all the flowers are blue or bluish. That effect is also quite visible in the daylight, but colors are slightly different. So this is something analogous to the color label in a supermarket and shows pollinators which flowers are better to pollinate. Of course, it is better to pollinate the just opening, pinkish flower. That, of course, will allow to concentrate pollinator efforts on flowers which is better to pollinate and therefore will increase the production of fruit and seeds. And the second thing is adhesiveness. Like adhesion of Desmodium is famous about these fruits. But what I see, all plant is adhesive. So adhesiveness of Desmodium is due to the effect quite similar to the gecko fingers. So gecko is a lizard which hunt almost on vertical walls. By the way, one of them is hunting right here, right now. So you can call this modium chameleon plant because it changes its color and also like to claim the vertical surfaces, at least virtually. So here also my microfibers like velcro-like fibers will allow plant to attach to other plants, plants like attach together or to skin of humans or my clothes. They're not like climbing vertical walls, but I think it's also quite useful. That will, for example, prevent herbivorous animals to go inside this Desmodium stakes. So there may be other factors as well, so you can think what else might be useful from being covered with Velcro-like hairs. So these are factors which help Desmodium change in color and Velcro-like surface. Thank you very much.